once pivot the road to paradise So guaranteed that I've been nice It's just that long road, hard road Dragging a little red wagon still with Six feet and no one What the fuck you fight on Where my time go? this episode of what's wrong with your 240 um, yeah it popped a gas line so I'm gonna go get some new stuff and fix that good thing I got my Jeep here <laughs> all right boys onward to AutoZone all right so back from the store cut some new fuel line hose I'm gonna uh, toss this in and show you how I did it uh, this should be pretty self-explanatory for anyone who doesn't know you got two lines one here one here um, I cut a little piece right here so I could pull this flap up to get easier access to it, no big deal. But um, yeah, basically I just undid them from here, slid them off, and then I gotta go underneath to get the rest. But in order to kind of get this like lined up, I'm gonna stick two ends on this and then just drape them down underneath so that I don't have to worry about it up top. So like I said, <clears throat> I cut a lot of extra just in case I need more and I'll make the final adjustment underneath, but basically I'm just gonna feed this down there and then plug both these in all right hopefully you can hear me over the exhaust but basically make sure you remember which line came out of which side I'm not sure if it makes a difference but most likely it does but I just matched them up I actually um, started it from down the bottom on the hard line and they came up here and then cut off what I thought was extra replace the fuel line hoses uh, the clamps and right now I'm letting the car run just to make sure it runs and stays running and then um, check for leaks obviously. Alright, well just like that, she got new fuel lines, you know, not too bad. Easy job, made sure she's running good, no leaks, boom. Hey, what's going on everyone? Um, I actually got a new phone. Um, and I upgraded big time, so the video content is going to be much better quality, hopefully. Actually, um, JD at Dirty Water Racing actually gave me a little hidden Easter egg on the Zenki, which I want to show you right now, which is, uh, I would have had no idea it was there. It works. <laughs> wow, it actually worked, that's crazy. Doing front brakes on the Jeep today, so that's what I'm gonna do in that box. Still so weird looking into like a new camera. Um, so, got the brakes done on the Jeep. That was pretty simple. Surprising that's like a really easy job, um, but glad for that. So real quickly, I'm gonna install the new um, gas tank trap door O-ring because mine ripped and it smells like gas inside the car. Surprise, surprise. Yo, this is cool. We're on 60 frames per second, so we're gonna, I'm gonna see if this really, oh my goodness. The quality is way better. I get a look at the camera. All right, we got our little bag here and uh, get the 240 real quick. So, we're gonna get in there. So this is the part. I got this off Parts Geek. Comes with uh, new hardware too, so hopefully this works. Okay, so what we're looking for is under this. Get out of here. Okay, so I got the new ring in, the new hardware on. Uh, so hopefully this doesn't leak anymore because it stinks and I don't like the smell of gas in my car, obviously. So we'll see. 